Row 18, plot 20. Hey everybody, welcome to Now It's Dark, I'm Jim. Today I'm doing an unboxing for a box that I picked up, a mystery box from any means necessary. Um, I uh, ordered some art prints and uh, a few other things from them in the past and I will hopefully link that video. Um, but any means necessary is a kind of a dark art um, website. Uh, Sean Cross, I believe is the gentleman's name. Uh, and some of it is um, geared toward depression awareness. And uh, I really enjoyed the dark art. I got a Wednesday Adams print, um, a few other things. But uh, they offered a mystery box. I think it was $35. Maybe there will be a uh, invoice inside. Um, I'm going to look. I'll let you look first. Looks like something on the top. Looks like a plate. Maybe a plate. Throw caution to the wind. Oh, okay. That's a frisbee. A frisbee. Kind of different. So I don't know really what uh, this is going to be. I believe there might be a shirt in here. A baseball hat. I'm not really a hat kind of guy, but uh, it feels very nice. That's their kind of like their mascot. Um, all right. Like I said, not really a mask guy. So here is what looks to be like an art print. And here is a very nicely packaged t shirt. Let's look at the shirt first. I like the uh, little zipper, Ziploc bag. Mmm, new t-shirt smell. <clears throat> Alright. This is 3X. Oh, I like this. Okay, isn't that great? Here's the front. It's like a guillotine. Look at that. That's really different. I really like that a lot. I like the red. It really pops with the gray and the black. Be nice uh, to have like a not black t-shirt to wear. I really like this. And it's, uh, it doesn't feel like it's going to like come off in the uh, laundry. It's a big deal. All right, let's take a look at the art print. It feels very heavy. Maybe there's more than one in here. But well, this does not seem like it's a very easy tube to get into. Oh, we're making progress. Oh, okay. Wow. Feels like there might be more than one. Oh, wow. Yeah, there's definitely more than one. Wow, what a great deal. There are three. Wow. Alright, so the first one I can already see, and it looks very beautiful. These look like they're 11 by 17, 11 by 12. Remove the skin, sin by sin. What do you think of that? Very nice. Love this artwork. All right, here's the next one. I have not seen it. Oh my god, this is incredible. It's Darkwing Duck. What? That's so cool. Uh, so, just weird side story here. I am a huge Darkwing Duck fan, and um, I play DC Universe Online. I actually have a Darkwing Duck character <laughs> costume. This is so freaking cool. Wow, that looks really awesome. That's crazy. I would not have expected that. I should have mentioned that some of the artwork is like licensed characters. Oh, this looks like it might be Coraline. Look at that. That's so incredible. That looks really good. Like what a dark take on both of these characters. Coraline is a beloved uh, movie 
by many nice signatures on the bottom um, this is a poster that I'll probably give away if I get the opportunity to um, I know someone uh, who is a big Coraline fan and uh, I think she would appreciate that so very cool so yeah check out the website any means necessary if you like this kind of artwork like I said it's a little bit of a dark take on um, some you know known characters licensed characters I guess you would call them and then there's also a bunch of other dark art and t-shirts and uh, all sorts of good stuff but uh, that's going to do it thanks for tuning in please hit the like button and if you would like to join the growing channel uh, subscribe thank you so Just think of me